Yo guys, Code Life here. So in today's video guys, I'm going to be showing you all how to set up a custom crosshair cursor. That's right guys, in this video we're going to be changing our cursor or pointer from previously being this standard Windows cursor to now being this awesome looking custom crosshair one instead. Which yeah, as you've all probably read from the title already, it's actually the exact same one that two popular Fortnite pros are using as we speak. That's Mongrel and Mitro. For real guys they're both using this exact one just in different sizes i'm pretty sure i think mitro right now is using a slightly smaller one and then mongrel is just using the standard one which i'll be showing you all in this video both of them too they absolutely love using this custom cursor and to be honest guys i can guarantee you right now that all of you will love using it as soon as you do set it up for yourselves i know i myself guys i did set this up like half an hour ago and i can tell you as all right now i've been enjoying mine and i fell in love with it it ever since then like for real going forward i'll be using this as my main cursor that's for sure it's just so much cooler and just different to the boring windows cursor like there's no way i'm ever going back to that one but yeah guys let's now not waste any more time and let's now jump into the video where i'll show you all how to set up the cursor that both mongrel and metro and even quite a few other pros are currently using as we speak so the first thing you all want to do guys is head over to your windows desktop and and on your desktop, you want to right click on the little Windows Start icon at the bottom left. And then from the list of settings that will appear, you want to click on the settings one. You'll then see the setting windows pop up. And in this, you want to click on that search box, type in mouse. And then once you have typed that in, you should see the little mouse settings drop down and you want to go ahead and click on that. After that, guys, you want to then click on the additional mouse options at the top right. And then another window should then pop up. And this is called mouse properties. In here, you want to head over to the points tab. And this is where we're going to be changing the cursor itself. To change it, it's super simple. All you guys have to do is literally click on one of the many cursor options, like the normal select one. And then once you have selected that, you then want to click browse. And in here, you want to find the cross icon. A super quick way to do this, guys, is to literally type C. And then it'll filter all of the ones that begin with C. And you'll see the cross icons. As you can see, there are quite a few different ones to choose from. But the exact one that we want to select is a one called cross underscore IL. As that's a one that both Metro and Mongrel use. However, though, guys, there is something very important you need to know about this exact one. That's the cross underscore IL one. And that is that it's actually been modified by both Metro and Mongrel. They don't use the exact Windows stock one. They actually use a modified one. The way in which they've actually modified this, guys, is by filling in the cursor itself. As if you didn't know already, for some reason, the standard Windows one, it features a blank line through the center, which essentially makes it transparent and not fully black. You can see here in certain parts of my desktop, when I do sort of move the mouse around, you can see that sort of reflection coming through. And that is because it is transparent. That's not exactly what we want though, guys, as we do want it to be fully black, just like Mongrel has it and just like Metro has it. However, though, again, guys, to achieve that, what we need to do is we need to customize this cursor itself. And to do just that, what we need to do is we need to head over to a website where we can actually customize cursors and for me what I'll be using today is a website called cursor.cc on cursor.cc guys all you've got to do to get started in editing the cursor itself is to simply click import image then choose the file that's cross underscore IL. And then you should just click upload and then boom, you're able to edit it. You'll notice straight away, guys, what I was talking about before with the cursor being transparent. You'll see that the reason why it's transparent is because of this blank center in the middle. To get rid of that transparency, what we want to do now is to fill it all up with black. It's pretty easy, guys. Just do what I'm doing here and just simply fill it in. And then once it is fully filled in, you are good to go. I will say though quickly, guys, if you all want to make adjustments to the crosshair itself, like maybe making it smaller or thinner, like Metro has it, I'd recommend doing those changes now rather than later. And yeah, once you have fully customized your cursor, you are ready to go. Just simply go ahead and click on that download cursor option. And then once it has downloaded, you want to head back over to your mouse pointer options 
and select the cursor you've just downloaded. To make things easier for me, what I did is I just simply renamed the downloaded cursor so that I could find it much easier. Once you have gone ahead and done that though guys, just go ahead and select every single cursor option and replace that with your new custom cursor. There is quite a few options to be fair so it might take you a little while guys, but once you have gone ahead and done that, your custom crosshair cursor will be consistent throughout and it'll look amazing. But yeah guys, that's literally all you've got to do in order to set up a custom cursor like Mongrel in Metro. As you can see guys, once you have done exactly what I did in this video, you'll see that it works perfectly. It works on the Windows desktop when you're moving stuff around. It works in Fortnite on the main menus and stuff when you're navigating the settings. And then it also works in Fortnite, the game itself, when you're in the inventory screen organizing your weapons. It's pretty cool guys, I'm not gonna lie. There's something just cool about having a crosshair for your cursor. I don't know what it is, there's not really any advantages to this, apart from it being just really, really cool. Like, be real, guys. What would you rather have? This awesome-looking custom crosshair cursor, or would you rather have this boring, standard Windows one? I know what I'd be choosing for sure, guys, and that's what I'll be sticking with moving forward. I'd love for you guys all to try this out, though, and let me know your thoughts. If you do enjoy it, guys, after trying it out, I'd appreciate it if you could drop a like on this video and let me know in the comment section below. And yeah, I hope this video helped you guys out. If it did, feel free to subscribe to the channel if you are new and use Code Life in the Fortnite item shop when you do purchase any skins. I'd appreciate that a ton, guys, and it'll help me out more than you know. And yeah, thank you all so much for watching. Hope you all have a great day. Peace.